Today we're going to show you how to use Power Patch Sealant. It seals transformer and pill cable oil leaks. For demonstration, I'm going to be using this fin from this transformer. First, find the leak. Then, clean the area. Then, using a wire brush or a sandpaper, remove all loose material and oxide at least three inches around the leak. Then put on your safety equipment, your eye protection and gloves. For active leaks, we're going to use power patch putty. First, cut off about a half an inch of the putty. Remove the plastic wrap. And knead for about two minutes until it's a uniform gray color. For small leaks, we'll r roll in a, a small piece of it in about the size of a pea. For large cracks or seams, we'll roll it into a rope about a quarter inch thick. For this one, we'll demonstrate using a pea-sized piece of putty. Right before you put on this piece of putty, you'll want to clean the area with TR solvent wipe to remove any oil. Place the putty over the leak and either put your thumb or the palm of your hands over the putty and hold it for about two to three minutes while it gets hard. Use the excess putty to judge when it is hard. The putty is now hard. You can remove your hand. The putty will hold for at least one hour while you put on the permanent seal power patch. To put on the permanent, the power, use the power patch, put the cartridge into the tool, close the thing, put on, then you'll want to prime it, make sure that both the black and white are com, resin are coming out, place on the static mixer, and prime the static mixer, about one pump. Right before you um, put this final permanent seal on, you'll want to clean it once more with another TR solvent wipe. Now you'll start applying the power patch. Place the power patch on the outside of the putty so it covers at least an inch half an inch to an inch beyond the, the putty or the leak. Then you'll want to build up the area so it's at least a quarter inch thick. Then use the tongue depressor to smooth the repair and smooth out the edges so it doesn't catch on into anything. The power patch now can be painted. After 15 minutes, the power patch will hold 20 pounds of oil pressure. When it's fully cured, power patch can hold over 100 pounds of oil pressure. Power patch can be used for fixing transformer oil and FS6 gas leaks pill cable leaks as well as lead splicing.